Hi everybody, it's me, Jenny. Welcome back to Craft Creations. So, I need to say a whole bunch of stuff and then we'll get into the video. Um, so in December, I had a few, quite a few actually, people ask me if I would show um, my planner and the way I set it up. But I was going to do it and then I thought, well, it's kind of silly. Let me just wait until I get the 2023 planner and then I'll do it then. But it took a, a long time. And with that said, I would like to say a huge shout out and thank you to Jessica, who is Creative Designs by Jessica here on YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, everywhere. <laughs> um, she is amazing. And she sent me a 2022 slash 2023 planner. So I took out the 2022 and I set it up with the 2023. Um, and I love it. So, and also she gifted me the cover, this, this gold cover or case. I'm not really sure what you would call it. Um, and I love it. This, she gave this to me either last year or the year before. I don't remember, but it's well loved. <laughs> I can tell you that. Um, so with all of that being said, I am going to walk you through and we'll just go over a bunch of stuff while we're going through it. Okay. Um, also this is the happy, the, oh, what do you call it? The big happy planner, not the classic or mini. This is like the, the biggest one they have, the mama jama. <laughs> You guys know I have to fit so much stuff and I used to have it where I had a planner for every single thing but for me that was way too chaotic I couldn't do it it was it was just making my life unbearable to be quite honest um, so now that I have everything in one place I absolutely love it and I also want to share um, she gifted me oh, she Jessica also gifted me this amazing calendar. I'm going to not show you January because I have a bunch of stuff written on it. So we're just going to go right to February. <laughs> but look at how cool this is. It's got craft creations on it. Oh my gosh, guys. Like, look at this. And she's got all the holidays and everything on this. So... Um, now, unfortunately, I don't know if she made this or had this made for me, but no matter what she did, I absolutely love this. I wanted to find a way to keep it on my desk, but if, if I do that, then every time I do a video, I have to move it. Um, because you know, I put my daily plans on here and I'm not sure that's really great to share all the time. And Anyway, so I have it off to the side now, <laughs> but I absolutely love this. Um, it has been like a godsend, especially just this month alone. So um, absolutely loving it. Sorry, I'll fix that later. Um, so yes, yeah, so let's just get into this and I will show you what and how or how and what I do with my planner. So yeah, so like I said, this is the big one. So it's, it's kind of hard to get it all in one shot so this is the cover and you open it up okay so let's well here let me just show you this real quick so this is the <laughs> sorry I told you this thing is huge so this is the one side um and I keep my paper clips and then under here I have some papers I have some extra dividers and then I have my book that has all my passwords in it for social media and stuff Okay, and then this side is the planner. So we're just gonna go from here. Now, like I had stated, Jessica sent me a um, planner. Thank God for her. Um, so for those of you who know me, you know that I love pastels and stuff. The planner that she sent me, this is actually, well, this is the back cover. <laughs> Um, but the cover looks exactly like this. It just doesn't have this part on it. And then, so this would be the back and then you flip it and then this is the inside. So what I did was for right now, I actually just took it off, but I wanted to show you what it looked like. Um, so there's that. I am waiting for she, okay, so, oh my gosh, guys, remember when I showed you this? She made this for me. Um, she also designed this part for me. So the new logo is actually from Jessica. Um, 
but yeah, so she made this for me for the classic planner. Um, and I was going to try to go back to the classic, but after being in a big one, it's really hard to do that. So she is actually making me a, um, cover just like this, but for the big one, because as you can see, it's, it's not big enough. So, um, and if you want to know the difference between the large and a classic, here it is. So this one is the classic and this one is the large, like the big happy planner is what they call it. Okay. So let's just get into this. So I took the cover off. Um, and with all of that said, the planner colors are basically gold and greens. <laughs> and I know a lot of you are laughing because you know how I am with the greens, but I have to say I am, um, a person who needs to not even likes to, but I need to match. It needs to be somehow coordinating because if not, it makes me crazy. Like my OCD kicks in and just forget about it. So I was going to change it all and just put like different papers on all of it, but here's the problem. So do you see these? So they're all like the greens and like the orange and like all these colors. So if I change the papers, it wouldn't all match anyway. So what I did was I found a paper pack that I have that does have some greens in it. So it works out. So I will show you that as we go. So I actually am loving this planner right now. I'm loving how I have it set up. Um, and so we're going to go with it. And then as soon as I get my cover, I will feel completely complete and we'll be good to go. Okay. So in the beginning or in the beginning, in the front here, um, I have this little pocket who's watzer and I have some functional stickers and just a bunch of stickers. So if I need them, I can grab them and put it on. So here is just, it's not anything. It's not, it's just a, one of these that I, I love her. Um, I'm probably going, as soon as I get the cover, I will take this out or recover it because this is silver. And as much as I love silver, everything else is accented in gold. And then this is gold. So to me, this doesn't go. So you know what? I'm just going to take this out now because this is going to drive me to drink. I did use it as a, um, one of these, but now I don't need it. So we're just going to ditch that. So it says <laughs> rejoice always. And then obviously these are the ones that came with the planner. But as you can see, <laughs> um, so on this side, I have this paper pack and this is the one that I used to coordinate with the rest of it. So I, I hope you can see it. So I love the way it came out. Um, so this is incoming happy mail. I haven't had any incoming happy mail for this year for 2023. But when I do, what I will do is I will come in here and I will, um, write down who gave it to me, um, send them a card, then write when I sent them like a thank you card or a thank you happy mail, whatever, however I'm going to do it. All of that information will go here so that I can keep track of it. And then also I don't fall behind with sending a thank you or returning the favor. Does that make sense? So my first one in here is incoming happy mail. And then the second one is outgoing happy mail. Um, and this says all <clears throat> do all things with love. Again, I love the folders. I think they're wonderful. And here I did pink because I needed to add some pink in because I know that I'm, I love pink. So, <laughs> and you'll, and, and there's also pink here too, ah, as you can see. So that will work. Um, so this is outgoing happy mail. This was from the very end of Christmas that I did. So um, this is all the happy mail and cards. I don't know why I have this in here because I, again, nothing yet for 2023. There will be very soon. Um, then the next section I have is for swaps and collabs. Um, I do have some information in that one, so I am not going to share that just yet, but this is another, um, paper that I put on this side of the folder um, and again, they're just all different shades of green, which is really cool. So again, we have incoming happy mail, outgoing happy mail, swaps and collabs. Um, and then obviously I am Sandy's um, social and media coordinator, direct, coordinator, directors. I'm sorry, <laughs> the title. I'm 
I've got so much information in my brain. But anyway, um, so yeah, so this one I just did the green on the, oh, don't want to show any of that. Sorry. <laughs> so here I have the, the decorate your life. And then I also have it here. So if I need to get to it really quick, because I do so much um, and I, you know, I'm constantly in here. So I have that one. And then behind that, I have the Facebook group. Uh, well, it just says Facebook group, but that's for decorate your life as well. Um, because I am helping her with that. So again, information don't want to show, but I have another, um, what do you call this? <laughs> this part. <laughs> so what I did too, and I will take this out so you can see. So this is a, oh, it just fell right off. This is a plastic, um, divider or whatever you want to call it. Um, so I just put the paper on it and did it that way. So we're just going to keep flipping. So that's face. So then, all right, so let's go over this again. Sorry, guys. We have incoming mail, incoming happy mail, outgoing happy mail, swaps and collabs. Then I have decorate your life, Facebook. Ugh, again. Um, giveaways. And this is for Facebook and YouTube. So if I do a giveaway, no matter where it's at on social media, all the information will go in here and right now I don't have anything so that's okay and then this full well section is companies I've worked for or work with um, and then after that starts the calendar so now I'm gonna be honest I did not I mean I set everything up but I didn't decorate it yet so I still have to work on that but I wanted to show you when this starts, so I have like some notes and stuff like that, that I, you know, no paper here. And then here I put these because these are really cool. It's like, it, these were actually for memory keeping. Um, but I love these so much that like, if there's like a special event that happens in say January, right. Um, and there's some pictures, I could put the pictures here. I can write about it. Um, I could, you know, obviously put pictures here, sweet memories, and then put little blurbs about it. And then I could put it in with that month. So I like having them in the front of the year so that when something special happens, I can go in, I can grab one, two, three, however many I need, decorate them, write down everything I want to write down, and then keep them in there because then that's also for memories. And I just love that idea that I'm able to do that and I can do it with absolutely every single month um that i i plan with so again it starts from january and goes all the way to december and all of these match and this is what i was talking about before um so you get your folder and all the folders are coordinating and matching and there's the green but like on the folders that i showed you before they have like a like all right let me take a breath <laughs> sorry guys so the folders that I showed you before are the folders from January to December of 2022. So you have this, but then on the back of it, you'll have like an older calendar. So you, I wanted to cover that up. Um, and I was going to cover both sides so that it did, wasn't green because green is really not one of my colors at all. But I then remembered that I had that paper pack that would go really nicely with all these greens and this part here, like, see what I'm talking about? These are tabs. I didn't know how or, and I didn't want to try to cover these because it's plastic. It's a pain in the butt. Um, so I didn't, I didn't have to, which worked out really well. So all I did was took my, um, label maker and I just wrote these that went over the date and it worked out perfect. You know what I'm trying to say? Okay. So then January, what I will do. So with the planner comes, um, this, and here's another thing that I did. I did it on this side and then I put some sayings here and then I covered it with this side. So I have to decorate all of this. This is for January. Now, January, you can also plan weekly. Um, and that's like the fun part, I think, of decorating a planner. I don't know if I'm going to use that function this year. I think what I might do is just keep the, the monthly calendar and then just not use, cause this is what the weekly would be. So it's, you know, Monday through Sunday. 
um, and then you can decorate it any way you want. But I don't know. I didn't really do that last year, and this worked out really, really well. So I think if I just do the monthly, um, I did. I do it in pencil so that when I go back and decorate it, I can just erase all of that and then just make it fun and flirty and just... You know what I'm trying to say? <laughs> so I most likely am going to do that again and just not do the weekly part of it. Um, and then also with Jessica, she has a Etsy shop. And as most of you know, um, I do do PR for her as well. Um, she does all kinds of planner stuff. So I for February as we get into here so she has um, well okay so this is February and as you know February is Valentine's Day so she has all of these amazing things in her shop and you can um, print them out their digis obviously you can make them as big or as small as you like um, and put them you know put them on sticker paper use them as stickers so you can decorate your planner which I will be doing but I also wanted to do this so I use 65 pound weight cardstock and I put these in the front so when something happens in February again something fun or exciting like look at how cute these are and again Jessica did all of these they're just amazing some are faith-based um but you don't have to use it for a faith-based. I also have a faith-based planner. <laughs> so I will be using these also in that. Um, but that's very personal to me. So I, I don't share that on social media. That's just my own. Um, but I will use these. And again, even though it does have faith in it, it's still... Very cute, very awesome. I love it. So again, if I wanted to put a picture here, put a picture here and then write about it, or if something just happened, say I just had a great day or I saw this really amazing video that I don't want to forget and I don't want to forget how it made me feel, I can come here, I can write it down um, and then put it in either that month or that week. You know what I'm saying? So that I always have it and I can do that throughout the month of February and March um, because you know, that's to me, those are the love months. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so I just, I love having these here and I love being able to have them as big as they are. Or if I just want to use this for note taking, bam, there you go. So if I have some ideas or brain dumps in the month of February, I can just jot everything that I'm thinking or that I want to do down here. And then say, if it's a swap idea, I could put swap and then write what I was thinking. And then I could put it back in with the swaps and the challenges. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Like, there's just so many ways you can use this. So I love these. She's got a ton more. Um, and just because since we're talking about it, <laughs> And it's right here to my side. Let me show you this fun. So this is um, one of the kits that she sells. So there is this and this. So you get these two. Um, I hope I'm in frame. So there's one that you could do with your boxes. And then um, this. So again, we'll probably be using this kit for the month of February. And, you know, again... It, is it, does it fit this? No, but you know, look, we can make things fit anywhere and do them in a way that works and is fun. So I'm really looking forward to doing the February monthly, um, with this. So we'll see how it goes. <laughs> um, but yeah, so <clears throat> this is my set, my planner setup. And again, it's from January to December, um, for 2023. I'm like, this is beautiful, I think. I just think it's so pretty. And I don't need a paper here because obviously I need the calendar. So so there we go. So we'll go through it one more time, super, super quick. And like I said, as soon as I get my um, cover, I will come back on and show you. I can't wait to see it. It's just going to be so awesome. So off to the side is just some personal stuff over here that I need and I need to get to. Here are some stickers. So um, say if I have a bad day and... I write about it or whatever. I could just put like shake it off or I could take it and put it in January for the 15th and just put shake it off. I'll know. Oh, that was a bad day. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So again, four files I have incoming happy mail, outgoing happy mail, swaps and collabs, 
Decorate Your Life Facebook. Um, and then I have giveaways for Facebook and YouTube, companies I work with um, online, and then it goes right into, well, then I have like the couple of things here, and then it goes into the calendar from January to December. So for those of you that were curious, there you go. <laughs> Let me know what you guys think. Um, you know, would this work for you? Is this kind of how your setup is? Um, I'm curious. I would really, really like to know. And is this helpful? Did it help help you in any way? Maybe if you plan on doing a planner or whatever. So, um, yeah, I'm sorry it took so long. But again, I wanted to get it set up. And this is basically exactly how I had my other one. The only difference was I think the um, calendar was in the front and this was more to the back. But I need these to the front. And I learned that towards the end of last year, just because there's just so much that I'm doing right now. Um, and now that I have the monthly desk calendar, that's going to be huge. <laughs> so yeah. So let me know what you guys think. And I'll leave all Jessica's information in the description bar below, just in case if you want to go check her out. Um, I will have some videos coming out soon using her, um, kits and stuff. So, um, as I said, I'm going to do the February with that one kit. I have a, um, some plans for the January. So yeah, definitely keep an eye out for them and that's it. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. As always, I would love to hear from you in the comment section and I hope to see you on my next video. I hope you guys are doing great. I love you and I'll see you soon. Bye.